The following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, from West Newbury, Massachusetts, weighing in at 248 pounds, John Cena. And the opponent, from Nesquahoning, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 300 pounds, Snitsky. A big New England welcome from Portland, Maine. This is good old JR Tim Ross here with Jerry the King Law. I've never seen a crowd so fired up, JR. They can't wait to get started, and neither can I. That makes two of us, King. I don't think Portland's going to know what hit it after tonight. we actually get paid to do this job, JR? It's like a dream come true, King. Except when I have to sit here and listen to you drool over the divas. Come on, JR. You know I'm helpless when it comes to puppies. Oh, I know, King. And that's why I'm bringing a pitcher of ice water out here with me next time. <coughs> Straddling that ring rope has got to be just about the most uncomfortable thing a human being can endure. No kidding, JR. That's worse than an all-day donkey ride. Rope break. If any superstar shows the slightest hint of weakness, they've lost the match. That's for sure. No matter how beat up you are, you can't ever let your opponent know the extent of your injuries. And that's easier said than done, JR. The human body can only absorb so much punishment. You can look at any professional sport you want, JR, and you won't find more incredible athletes than the WWE superstars. You're not wrong, King. They compete every week until they are physically incapable of continuing. Oh. There's no off-season in the WWE. We're not talking about running a ball down a field or slapping a puck into a net. This is serious physical competition. It sure is. The Ugh. toughest athletes in the world are on... Uh-oh. Come on. You got to stop this guy before he really gets going. I don't think that's going to happen, King. He's built up too much momentum to be stopped now. Look at him feeding off the energy from this capacity crowd. He's unstoppable. You can't ever count on these fans, JR. They're fickle, and they'll abandon you in a heartbeat. You're not going to get him with that one. Ugh. Be 
watching these superstars compete against each other here tonight, JR? I had a feeling their paths are going to cross sooner or later. And I'm glad I'm here to see it. Me too. It almost makes it worth having to sit next to you and listen to those corny expressions of yours. What the heck is a government mule anyway? It's what you get beat like. We're in the middle of a slobber knock. And if you don't have the guts to stick around, you might run like a scalded dog with a case of the limber tape. All right, all right, enough! I'm getting a translator before I have to come out here with you again. This is raw action at its finest. That's why Raw is the number one brand of sports entertainment. You got that right, JR. You're not going to see this kind of action on SmackDown. Not on SmackDown or anywhere else. There's nothing else out there that can come close to the excitement of seeing the Raw superstars perform live. A reversal. Can he capitalize on it? That went nowhere. There aren't many superstars as diversely talented as John Cena. He's as good in the ring as he is on the microphone, and that's saying something. I won't argue with you about Cena's mic skills. He sure can't talk a good game, but when it comes right down to it, I don't think he can back it up. King, you're as crazy as a pet coon. Did you happen to notice how many times Cena's worn gold around his waist? Seems to me like he's got no problem putting his money where his mouth is. What a counter! Oh. This capacity crowd is solidly behind <laughs> their superstar. Look at this! Wow, could you be any more biased, JR? How about some fair and balanced commentary? After some of the things we've seen in this ring, JR, I think we'd better remind the folks at home not to try this stuff themselves. That's for damn sure, King. The WWE uh. superstars are trained professionals. And even they don't walk away from every match in the best shape. They uh. sure don't. We've seen more than one superstar taken out of here on a stretcher. This has gone beyond just being a match, JR. I think these superstars genuinely hate each other. There's no love lost between these competitors, that's for sure. If looks could kill, somebody would be pushing up daisies right now. And you've got to admit, that makes for a much more interesting match, JR. It sure does. But I just hope these superstars can settle their differences in the ring and leave it at that. I tell you, King, I've got no earthly idea how these superstars can maintain this intensity week after week after week. It's not easy, JR. There's no off-season. It's not like you've got six months to recover after WrestleMania. That's for damn sure. And that's why I don't think there can be any doubt in anyone's mind that the superstars of the WWE are the greatest athletes in the world. how the WWE or the American Dental Association can allow a monster like Snitsky to compete. Simple. A monster like Snitsky makes the rest oh. of the roster kick it up a notch. You can't just go through the motions when you're in a match with a guy who wants to rip your head off. You might be right, but I have to wonder 
if the risk is worth the reward. I'll be honest with you, King. This is not the way I thought this match would go at all. Me neither, JR. I guess that just goes to show that anything can happen in the WWE. I think you hit the nail right on the head, King. And it I don't like the look in this freak's eye, folks. It's not his eyes you got to worry about. What a wicked pump handle slam! <laughs> Here's your winner.